welcome to the third annual Chili Cook-Off. And I'm Mayor Davria Simpson. OC News is brought to you by the broadcast journalism students of the Communications Department at Cal State Fullerton. In world news, the focus is on the attack in Brussels, which claimed 31 lives and left over 270 people injured. Eight Americans are among the injured, and American students studying abroad were also in the vicinity of the attacks. Hello, this is our Davria Simpson reporting for Titan TV. I'm standing in front of the USS Iowa here in Long Beach, where today they're having a Veterans Day celebration. Make sure you stay prepared for emergencies here in California with earthquakes. But for now, we are only dealing with early June gloom. That's all for weather. Back to you. Thank you. After being launched last year to much fanfare, Apple is planning a sweeping overhaul to the interface of its Apple Music service. Is it the pumpkin spice latte or just our human addiction to coffee? As a graduate of Cal State Fullerton, how did Cal State Fullerton prepare you for your career? Cal State Fullerton's Women and Adult Reentry Center kicked off Women's History Month with the film Real Women Have Curves. Dr. Elizabeth Suarez spoke at the event and talked about issues Latina women face growing up. The Dog Cafe's mission is to revolutionize dog adoption by reinventing the way people connect with rescues who need homes. The Dog Cafe offers a comfortable and fun space for humans and dogs to hang out with each other, away from overcrowded shelters. This newly opened cafe allows patrons to drink tea and coffee while playing with puppies up for adoption. And we've had three dogs adopted so far, two more that are pending. And we're really careful just to make sure that all dogs uh, go to the perfect forever home. So we have a lot more applications than we actually do adoptions just because we really make sure to select the right people. This is Oreo. He's 15 years old and blind. He, along with many other dogs, have been rescued from nearby shelters. They are the dogs who have been at the shelter the longest and have the highest risk of being euthanized. Betsy. And Betsy was in the shelter. She probably would have been euthanized quickly because she was, we could not touch her. She would attack us. Um, her owner took her to a shelter for a doggy abortion and never picked her up. So here she is and she's completely rehabbed. She's friendly. She's like the pack mother and doing great. Something really awesome for the cafe to, for there for to be a place where dogs, um, people could meet the dogs that are in the shelters. Um, they have a lot of dogs that have been in the shelter for a long time. So they pull them out and then they try to give them more attention so that they can be up for the option. I think it's something really great that Advanced reservations are highly recommended. They're open Tuesday to Sunday, and it's a great way to find your new furry friend. They're besties forever. I'm Eric Davria Simpson reporting at the Dog Cafe in LA for OC News. News and Entertainment this week covers new movies, literature, the TV show The Voice, where Christina Aguilera... Good evening, my name is Eric Davria Simpson reporting for Titan TV. Right now I'm standing in front of the Avalon Ballroom in Hollywood. Today, 50 cents became a quarter. He admitted to using fake money in his social media posts and photos. The rapper once held a net worth of $155 million now has to answer to a judge who wants full transparency. However, I can't say the same about the national weather. We have current tips in the Midwest. Denver here is at 45 degrees. Albuquerque, New Mexico got that uh, cold end at 39 degrees. And into Chicago and Illinois, the temperatures are decreasing by the hour due to a heavy snowstorm moving in. Doctor Strange is a forthcoming Marvel movie to be released this November 2016. However, there is huge controversy surrounding one of the main characters, named the Ancient One, who is in the comics a Tibetan male. In the film, they cast a white female, Tilda Swinton, to play the character. You wonder what I see in your future? Multi-instrumentalist 
record producer and actor. He is a legend and multi-pop icon. The community behind me was so shocked when they heard of his death. I heard the news today when I was actually on the train to go to work. So I was on the metro and uh, I got a text from a friend and it just, it said, it said dude Prince and I was actually hoping that she was gonna say Prince is coming back into town, like touring again, gonna like play 20 shows at the forum again. And I searched it online. My mouth just fell open. I thought I was, I thought the uh, TV was wrong. I could not, you know, uh, I was stunned. I called people and they were stunned like I was. It was just, it's still hard to believe it happened. So, you know, I was so looking forward to his next tour. And I'm going to get his book. And How did you feel when you heard about the news that Prince had passed? I was just so devastated about Prince leaving the world. Rest in peace, Prince. You always be remembered. I was kind of depressed because me and Prince, we don't know each other personally, but it seemed like he knows me. Uh, he's a legend. He'll never be, uh, he'll never be replaced. Never. I'm Eric Davrius Simpson, reporting in Lamert Park, California, for OC News. Greece has now sent the first migrants back to Turkey as part of a controversial new agreement reached between the EU and Turkey to deal with Europe's migrant crisis. Three boats carried more than 200 people from the Greek islands of Lesbos and Chios. According to Greek officials, migrants need to apply for asylum. A Turkish official said, Turkey has agreed to accept up to 500 migrants per day. Protesters opposed to the deportations also gathered at Dikili's port one held a sign reading, Refugees Welcome, This Is Your Home. where you can say due to the holidays, there's been an increase in traffic. The city council meetings are also broadcasted on Time Warner Cable, Channel 35. My name's Air Davrius Simpson reporting for the report. Thank, Thank you, you so much for being here today with us. My name's Air Davrius Rose Simpson with the report program, and we'll see you next time. Coming soon. <laughs>